Hey guys, Rob the Plumber. Here is a video I've been meaning to put out for quite a while. Uh, this is the wire stripper I use to strip all my scrap wire. Um, yeah, it doesn't have a motor on it and it's not really fancy. But it is super basic and that is a good thing. This wire stripper can do every size of wire, single strand, multi strand, uh, three wire Romex, two wire Romex, it's actually really good that I made this video as late as I did because it is the end of the season, snow's on the ground, and I have put over 800 pounds of bright number one through this wire stripper. Uh, the gross weight was close to 1300 pounds of uh, insulated wire. I haven't changed a blade on it. I haven't sharpened the blade on it. And really, it's not in need of a sharpening anytime soon. The cost is the main factor, though. This wire stripper basically cost me 20 pounds of copper. There are three adjustable rollers um, that you set your wire size to. And now, it's not an exact science, and you don't have to be exact. You can see here I have it strapped down with two C-clamps. There is two holes in the bottom of it that you can screw down to a block of wood or a rail. You just want to make sure it's solid. That's the most important thing. The bit is actually held in with an Allen screw. It comes with an Allen key. And it is basically like a drill bit shaped down to a blade. The body is basically just a piece of hard steel. Here I'm putting through a piece of number 10 three wire Romex. Normally with most strippers, almost every stripper has a hard time with this size of wire, this type of wire. It's very bumpy. Uh, main thing is to have this uh, stripper locked down because when you start to pull on it, it basically just cuts a big groove right down the outside casing of the plastic. I'm actually going very slow here. Normally, I will pull the wire through the stripper much quicker. I'm just trying to show you the nice clean groove it cuts in the plastic casing. Now, with three wire Romex, this unit still is not perfect. It still takes a physical bump to get the casing off of the wire but well worth it there's a lot of copper inside of this three wire Romex the real work comes when unraveling the braided wire here's some 6-3 burial wire that I've already moved the outer casing from this is where the unit really really pays off you can get a pound a foot from this type of wire. Here you get a good view of just how easy it is to adjust. Once the unit is set, It just cuts that casing like nothing.
and you get a big pile of scrap plastic very very quickly. My local recycling company has no problem taking it. This is how much copper you get from an hour's work. It doesn't look like much, but there's over 10 pounds here. This is approximately how much this wire stripper costs. This amount of copper right here. Why would you spend 10 times this amount on a wire stripper that you got to replace blades on? Some blades sell for the amount of copper that's right here. It just doesn't make sense. If you like the video, rate and subscribe. I'm Rob the Plumber. Thanks for watching.